adding layers we're going to go up to the layer property dialog box and then in the layer property dialog box we're going to go up to the button here on the left it says new layer when I click on this button it automatically creates a new layer and by default it gives it a layer one name it just doesn't know what to name it so it gives it a name so I'm going to type in center for center lines and symmetry lines I can hit enter as a way of entering in the, uh, the command and so I have the layer in I'll do that again I'm going to go up to new layer I'm going to type in construction where these are for construction or projection lines instead of hitting enter I just can pick out into the screen and it'll accept that uh, layer I can also right click and say new layer and in here I can say dimension and I can hit enter and it'll create the layer name uh, so I can go up to the new button and I can also type in hidden with a comma generates another layer so whenever I hit comma that's another method of creating a layer while I'm in here uh, typing away and I'll say object and I'll hit enter so these are some mechanical uh, uh, layers and the object layer is our object line this is probably one of the most used layers in the mechanical it's our visible lines of the edges so we can add layers here into our layer properties manager if I close the dialog box and I want to add a layer I have to come back to the layer properties dialog box and choose a, a method add a layer and I'll call this one sheet and I can hit enter and now I'm done creating my layers for my mechanical drawing at this time